Good morning, everyone. It's been a bit since I have vlogged. Uh, I was on vacation last week, and then the week before was just kind of crazy. So it didn't happen. Where are you going? <laughs> but today is Monday. It's around 8 a.m. Rose actually slept in this morning. We both slept in because she was sleeping. But right now we have our morning sweaters on, and we're just hanging out. Getting back into the swing of things. We got back from vacation on Saturday. So yesterday I just kind of like, you know, did laundry, grocery shopping, cleaned the house up a little bit. Well, a little bit. Uh, the ha there's still things that I need to get to put away and stuff like that. But for the most part, we are back into the swing of things. Huh, Rose? What's better than coffee and donuts in the morning, hmm? Oh, yeah. And this cute little nugget. Hi. She was in a really bad mood yesterday. Yesterday was kind of a long day, but she seems to be happy this morning. She slept all night <laughs> and even like slept in, like I said, so. Tell them about our vacation. We went to Orlando and hung out with, we hung out with uh, Anthony's family. He unfortunately couldn't go because he had to travel for work. Oh yeah, he's still gone. Did I mention that? <laughs> he's not gonna be home until Saturday and today's Monday. So we still have a few more days without him. So he couldn't go, but and it was super fun. I had such a good time visiting with all of them. Excuse me. <laughs> she looks like Rose. <laughs> and Rose did really great. She is amazing, as usual. She did get a cold halfway through the week, which was kind of sad. She had a rough time sleeping and napping and that kind of stuff. But it was a good time. So anyways, it seems like she's in a better mood today, so hopefully she is all recovered and settled back into home life. She definitely misses being around people, though. We went to the grocery store yesterday, and she was flirting with everybody that would catch her eye. Like, even the the <laughs> the guy who was bagging our groceries, she kept trying to look at him, and she was looking and smiling, looking and smiling, and he wouldn't, like, make eye contact with her because he was, like, a 15-year-old boy. Hey, Rose has a new skill that I should show you guys. Okay, first of all, she really likes the remote, but now she can like lunge to get things. See, I put it this far away. So close, girl. <laughs> yeah, she just goes for it. Good job, Rose. So she didn't finish her cereal. Is it a good idea to give it to her to play with? Let's see how much of a mess she makes. She already got her sweater. Can you feed yourself? <laughs> of course she goes right for the butt. <laughs> good job, you're trying. Oh my gosh. Good job, Rosie. Good job, Eaton. You gotta turn it around. Did you get messy? How fun. How fun. <laughs> it's 11.30 now and Rose and I are both ready for the day. She took a nap and I, see while she napped, I did my nails, I worked out and I took a shower and I got all ready. I'm really happy with how my nails turned out. I did the fake stick on nails, haven't done them in a long time, but they were at Kroger. Yesterday I went out grocery shopping and they were like $6, so very happy with them. Today I just have to run a couple errands. Most important one is I need to return these dresses over here. I was looking for a dress for my brother-in-law's wedding, which is in a couple weeks, and I needed something that obviously was breastfeeding friendly. So I ordered a bunch of wrap dresses and just picked the one I like, and then I'm gonna return the ones I didn't choose. And then Rose and I need to run to the store, the baby store, cause girls growing up. 
She just needs some 12 month onesies because her nine month ones are getting a little snug down near the bottom, you know. Guys, look at her pigtail. <laughs> it's so stumpy. <laughs> so yeah, but, so anyways, that's my point. I'm gonna eat lunch and then we're gonna run our errands. sandwich and my worst fear has been realized I have a new jar of pickles and Anthony's out of town and I can't get the pickles opened I don't know what I'm gonna do how do I eat this sandwich without a pickle you guys this is a high alert emergency maybe one of my neighbors no they're at work right now Maybe they'll come later and open them. I tried so many ways. I tried different claws. <laughs> I guess no pickles for lunch, huh? This is so crazy because literally I've, I've had this thought too. Like, oh my gosh, what if Anthony's gone and I have a new jar of pickles and I can't open the pickles because usually he opens the pickles. And guess what? It happened. I can't open the pickles. Well, that sandwich was disappointing. I'm really so sad. I have to, I'm gonna have to like talk to our neighbors and things because I can't go a whole week without pickles. Anyways, I got Rose loaded up in the car and let's go run our errands. We're back from our errands. Rose is down for a nap, and I probably will just chill while she's sleeping. Let me show you guys what I got for Rose. First, and this is like the most important thing I wanted to get, was a crib liner, because I am so sick of having to crawl around the floor and get her passies, and she throws them out of the crib. And then also her like legs and arms get stuck, you know? It's like mesh, so they don't, they're not, she's not gonna suffocate or anything. It'll just contain everything in there. It was really nice when, we were on vacation and she was sleeping in a pack and play. I didn't have to worry about her passies at all. So I, after that, I decided I was like, okay, we're finally getting one. So that was exciting. I got her some new onesies, like I said. I just got the Carter set, so those are always the best. This one has some pink in it, but the other colors, there's gray, black. I don't usually get pink for rose, but I don't know. This was, all the ones that they had there, this one was pretty cute. And then again... I like this one because it's more just plain. I don't know. I'm not a big like print color person. <laughs> kind of boring, I know, but I thought these ones were nice. I hope this mauve looks okay on her skin tone. But these seem huge. Look how like long they are. But the nine months are too small, so I don't know. This is this is the next size up. Okay, and then I got her. I'm trying to find an outfit for her for my brother-in-law's wedding. And I got this skirt, which I really, I like this skirt a lot. The colors on it are cool. And I have a navy dress and Anthony's going to be in a navy uh, tux, I think. He's a groomsman. And so this maroon, coral, white color will go with that, I think. But the issue I have is this is like the onesie that goes with it, which I don't know. It just seems like that's a lot of, a lot of, the flowers are really pretty. Like this is pretty on its own. And this is pretty on its own, but I feel like together, I don't know, it seems a little busy for me. So maybe I might return this because the other option is on this set of onesies, this white or like off white goes with it. See, that looks so much better, doesn't it? Maybe I'll just return the other one. I was like thinking about it as I was driving home and I was like, I don't know if that's going to go. 
So I think we're going to stick with that, but I'm really excited for this skirt. I love how like big and fluffy it is. And I think this will be easier than a dress because I don't have to worry about it like going up to her pits. And then lastly, I just couldn't resist. I had to get some little bows like these because now she can do pigtails or ponytails, I guess. So I can clip these to her. <laughs> They're too cute. So yeah, that was fun. I got my dresses returned, so that's all good. Like I said, I'm just gonna chill for, hopefully she sleeps for like an hour or so. Someone's up from their nap. <laughs> Look how extra this is. Oh, she keeps tilting her head. <laughs> Look at this stuff, <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is what an only child looks like, you guys. Rose. What a doll. You look so cute. Where are you gonna go? You gonna get moving? I'm gonna get out of your way. Go ahead. What? <laughs> your leg's kinda stuck. <laughs> You're flexible, girl. Get it, Rose. Can you get it? She's trying so hard to reach. <laughs> it is five o'clock now. I just fed Rose. Uh, I made her like a smoothie, basically. It was yogurt, applesauce, banana, and spinach. She liked that a lot, so that's good. Man, she's driving me crazy, though. She's just been like whining and unha unhappy, and I guess she's not um, she's not entertaining herself like she usually does which is kind of annoying. But like I said, five o'clock, so I might, it's kind of nice out. I think I might go for a long walk with her. Can I walk for an hour? Is that too long? What do you think? <laughs> what do you want to do? I don't know. We'll kill some time, we'll go for a walk, and then put her to bed. I'm eating dinner now. Rose fell asleep. She had a hard time going down. I'm not really sure why. Lots of crying, but she's asleep now. Um, I'm just gonna eat dinner and probably relax for the rest of the night. I still haven't been able to get the pickle jar open. I've tried many times. I think if I can't get it by tomorrow, I will gonna text my neighbor and see if he'll come over and do it. This is a big deal, people. It may not seem like a big deal, but it's a big deal to me. If you're new here, I eat, I just really like pickles. There's nothing, it's not that complicated. I just really like pickles. And I really like having pickles with my sandwiches, especially. <coughs> so. The fact that my husband's not going to be home for, I don't know how many days, four, four five days? We'll, we'll figure it out. Thanks so much for watching, you guys. I hope you enjoyed our day. Like and subscribe. See you later. Bye.